Hello my darlings, Jane Borges here from Sam Within Me Homes bringing you another new home construction video. Okay, so we are here in Spring Hill, Florida and we are in a new community here. Now this is an Adams home community. They're going to have 75 homes built in here. Now I just wanted to show you how the community looks right now. I have another video I did a while back before they even started building in here. This is going to be public sewer and water sidewalks will be put in uh they did not do it yet but as you can see they're still under construction all right so for those of you that are curious to learn how new homes are built i'm going to show you just some of the basics with this particular builder okay so you'll see one of these once they have the house in permitting and this is how the lot's going to look they didn't do anything yet but i mean the lot is cleared but they didn't start building yet. They can't start building until the house comes out of permitting. All right, so once the house comes out of permitting, they're gonna start digging. I'm gonna show you over here, they have the slab down. They're gonna dig out for the space of the home. They're gonna put in the uh, plumbing fixtures and stuff like that. They're gonna get it all prepped and then they're gonna put the slab down all right, so I'm gonna show you this one in particular. This one is gonna be a small 1368 square foot home. So I'm just gonna show you this here. This is how it looks when they put the slab down. So this is gonna be the garage, two car garage. Okay, then if you can see that little slab there that's going to be the front door you see how they have everything sticking up for the plumbing so when they're ready to get that going it's already pre-done this is how it looks okay so after slab then they go and use the concrete block like you see there then after that they put the roof on all right all right so here's another house in the community I'm going to show you so as you see close up so it goes from slab then they put the cement block so you can see this is an Adams community they do build their one story cement block after they have the cement block here in particular, they're putting the windows in because there was a shortage of windows, so now they want to make sure they got the windows in. No shortage, okay? Then they put the trusses up. And then, I'm short, bear with me. They get the roof prepped. And then like you see over there, maybe not, over there. They put the roof on. All right, so let's go inside. What do they do? They put the framing in. The wiring. Continue running the plumbing. See the plumbing over there? Now they can put all of these things in and this is what the next phase of the home looks like. Now I'm not going step by step. I'm not a construction worker. Bear with me, I don't know the exact terminology of everything. I sell the homes, I don't build the homes. <laughs> this is gonna be the countertop for the kitchen. Ooh, can you feel that? It's a nice breeze. <laughs> See, so for those of you that are curious to see, well, how does this look when they're putting it together? So it's gonna be your ventilation system, AC unit, where all that comes out, electrical. Now I wanted to show you here, um, I 
believe, is it this? Yes. All right, so there's gonna be little wires. You see, did they run the little wires yet? For the uh, pest control system. I don't think they have the wires yet. No, they don't have the wires yet. But there's gonna be like a thin, very thin, thin wire that they run. And it's gonna be all along the walls. They didn't run it yet. And that's the um, in the wall pest control system that they have. And it's gonna be all throughout the house. They're also gonna spray part of, they didn't do it yet. I'll see if in another home they have it done and the, the wire that I can show you too. Um, they spray this like a green color and that also helps for pest control. All right. But this is what this phase looks like. So this is a bedroom, closet, bath. See, they put that in. Another bedroom. And then the master over here. The lanai. See, and you can see here they're still doing what they need to do. The master, double sinks here. You can see the plumbing for the double sinks. Tub, it's gonna be shower. Walk-in closet. The potty, and another closet. All right, so let's go and take a look at a home that's a little bit more complete for you. Okay, so here we are in another house. This one has the tube I was telling you about for the pest control, and it shows you the green spray I also mentioned to you. All right, so you can see there's a green spray, and it goes all around inside. See it in the background. So it's throughout the home, as you can see. Okay, and then this is the tubing I was telling you about. Now, you, you're not going to be able to see. It's got little tiny pinholes in it, but this is the wire, the tube. So as you can see, it goes all around. So they have um, the system on the outside of the house. Somebody will come once, like every three months from home team. They'll spray in the walls, and there will be a non-toxic -tox non -toxic spray that comes out of the little pinholes in here and goes whoosh throughout the walls everywhere that you see the green because they're going to have that wire everywhere all right they didn't finish doing it everywhere yet but they have it installed here for now so you can see see how it's attached and they got it all situated and figured out all right so that's the pest control system that's built in now across the street is actually a house that's just in cement block after the slab so i'm going to go across the street real fast so i can show you that i'm also trying to pick the homes that if you hear in the background there's construction going on I'm trying to pick the homes to show you today in this video that are not being worked on okay so let's see now this one, this is, this is the lot, so you have no neighbor to your left, no neighbor behind you. You'll have like one neighbor on the right. I don't know if this one's already under contract, but if it's not and you're interested, it's pretty much the side, but you put a fence up, you know. They have a lot of, um, and this is a cul-de-sac. Hello! This is a cul-de-sac. Hello! <laughs> so this is the cul-de-sac. So there's um, two cul-de-sacs in here. So let me show you. This is how it looks when they go from slab to cement block. Then they put the trusses up. They do the roof like I showed you before. Then they go into frame. Then they put up the sheetrock. 
I don't think there's any homes right now in here that are at sheetrock stage. They're either at frame or they're like almost done. So I'm just going to show you a home that's almost done. Hang on. Okay, so here's another home that I can show you the construction process. Now this is the insulation before they put the sheetrock. So as you can see, here's the sheetrock. All right. And then here's the insulation that they put in. So these homes are insulated, even though it's Florida, the homes are insulated for those of you that were wondering. Okay. So you see, this is how they do it. Still working on it, not done. Okay, and then I can show you a home that's completed because um, that's all that they have going on here in the community at this time. Okay, now this one is a completed home in this community. It's a three bedroom, two bath, two car garage, about a little less than 2,000 square feet. Now this one still needs to have some touch-ups done, but it can close in 30 days if you're interested. So this is how it looks when it's done. So you have carpet here in the living room, bedrooms, tile. This is that plank tile in the wet areas. Dining area here. Kitchen there. I'm just going to show you this side real fast. Front door. Okay, so we have a closet here. Oh, it's got that carpet smell. I like carpet, I don't mind. And I don't mind this, this is touch-ups, like I just mentioned, okay. So you have a bedroom here. Closet. Nice size. Bathroom. Another bedroom. This is bigger than the one in the back. Your view. Closet. Lots of natural light. Look at that. It's about, mm, I don't know, 3.30. All right. Front door. Dining area. Living room. Nice, decent-sized living room space. Kitchen. Nook. Back door. The master is there. We'll get there in a minute. Wait until you see that bedroom. Okay, so let's go over here. So there are blinds in the door. So this is going to come all the way down. There's the handle for it. It's the backyard. So there will be no back neighbor here. Okay, this house, as of today, March 30th, that I'm doing this video, this house is for sale. There will be no back neighbor. Okay. We have an outlet here. Stainless steel. It's not blue. This is just the uh, plastic over it that peels off and then it's the silver stainless steel. When I first saw it, I was like, oh, they're doing blue now. And then I was like, derp. No, that's that needs to be peeled off. Okay. The stove is included that will be put in there. There's your microwave. So the stove is here. 
So they'll install that. You do have to get your own refrigerator though. That does not come with the home. And this would be the space standard size. Okay, now here we have the laundry room. You have to get your own washer and dryer. The builder does sell them uh, as an upgrade if you want to add it and you don't want to have to go to like Lowe's or anything like that to order it. You can do that. And then this is the door for the garage, which they have some supplies in there, so I'm not going to open it up. There's your pantry, your laundry. Let's go and see the master. Check out the size of this master. Ready? So you have your tray ceiling. Nice big master. I'm up against the wall. So you get an idea of the size. This um, floor plan was a model in another community and they were actually able to fit a king size bed in here, a dresser, a chaise lounge, um, lounger, and there was still plenty of room to walk. So here's the master bath, double squared sinks. You can put your laundry baskets here or whatever you want. Do a little vanity. Okay, you have the tub, the shower, which is tiled all the way to the top. And you still have a linen closet, which is very, very nice. And then private area for the potty. Yes, I still say potty. Towel rack, and here is the walk-in. Ta-da! All right, so like I said, this exact house is for sale. If you're interested, let me know. I believe this house, as of today, March 30th, 2023, is going for, I think it was either three, right, well, I want to say around 316, because there's a, another one coming up. So I don't want to tell you the correct price now, and then it's the other house. And here's the door to the backyard. See the blinds I was telling you about? So if you're interested, my contact information is down below in the description box. Please fill out my registration form. By re filling out my registration form, you acknowledge that you are hiring me as your realtor. I get paid by the builder, not you, so no worries. But the builder is only going to pay one realtor, so if you are already working with a realtor, I cannot help you, so please do not contact me. All right, peace and love, and I will see you in the next video.